So, you and the Chief, huh? Good for you two. How the big idiot makes you happy. I'd like to know more about the Iron Bull. The Chief. Last time I met him, he saved my life. I never thought I'd work for a canary, but he grows on you. You must know him as well as I do, what with you two being... that. But ask, and I'll tell what I know. How did a Tevinter soldier wind up in a Canari spy's mercenary company? I wasn't a soldier at the time. I was in some trouble, trying to flee Tevinter. A Tribune and his men caught me in a border town tavern. They meant to make an example of me. Bull killed them. Gave up his eye doing it. Patched me up and asked if I was looking for work. I've been putting up with his jokes ever since. That's how he lost the eye? Yes. The guards had me on the tavern floor when Bull came inside and yelled for them to stop. One of them saw trouble coming and figured he'd finish me off. The guard had a flare. Bull put himself between me and the blow. They can't, idiot. Didn't even know me. How's Iron Bull as a commander? If you know what you're doing and hold up your end, he's easy. He doesn't accept any less. If he keeps us alive, he leads from the front, and if you've an idea that'll win the fight, he listens. I've seen bands whose captains had to prove they were swinging the biggest sword. Bull isn't like that. The charges might give him more lip than you'd expect, but every one of us would lay down our lives for the big ass. Is it strange to work for Kunari? He hasn't tried to convert us to the Kune, if that's what you're asking. The Bull's charges don't care who you light a candle for, so long as your shield stays up. If he hadn't told me he was Ben Hasroth, I'd have thought he'd left that life behind. I didn't expect he'd tell you all that he was a spy. Not the whole band, but those who've been around long enough to trust. He figures most of us would find out sooner or later, and it should come from him. Eyes to eye, he says. It's never messed up a job. He just writes letters back home. Lots of the boys write letters back home. We'll talk later.